do you think life is? That's a good question. And we can answer it from a very boring way. We can talk about it, that we have a responsibility to reproduce and we should have children. But I think life is many different stages. And I think that at the beginning, especially, and for a long period, you learn. You do learn the whole way through life, but you, you learn. And once you've learned enough, I think you get to a stage, and I'd like to feel like I'm almost there. Maybe you're 30, maybe, maybe at end of your 30s. You've learned enough to implement all of the lessons and, and live a good life. And then I think once you get older, let's say 60 something plus, you don't live for yourself anymore. You live vicariously through the people you care about. That's what I believe. I think that by the time I'm 60, I'm going to be more interested in what my kids are doing than what I'm doing. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm not 60. I'm just guessing. But I think that's what life's all about. I think it goes through different stages. And I've never really seen, and the reason I say this is, the old people I know who are on their deathbeds, they're only sad to die because they're going to miss me. They're not sad for themselves. I don't know if you ever noticed that. They're like, I'm going to miss you. Uh, what are you going to be okay? They're worried about you. Like they're, they're, so, they're living through you so much. They're so vicariously living through you that their concern is for you. They don't, they've lived enough. So they kind of get to a point where like, well, I don't want to live. I don't care about me, but are you going to be okay? It's kind of weird. But it was the same thing for me in jail. I'd call my mom and say, are you okay? Is this okay or that? And she goes, I can't believe you call me from a jail and I'm trying to ask if you're okay. And you're saying I'm fine. And all you care about is me. Yeah, because I'm my man. It's kind of what I'm supposed to do, right? 